Hey, how's it going? Welcome back to another Hardcore Iron Man Progress video. And we made those upgrades in the last video. We got the torso, we got the black dragon high chaps. So now we're all ready to get back to Slayer and start working towards getting 85 Slayer for Abyssal Demons and hopefully to get a whip. We're going to be doing all the clue scrolls along the way as well while training Slayer, as long as they're not willy clues. And hopefully we can pull something good and make even more upgrades. But yeah, we're heading back to the waifu, Neve, to get our next Slayer task. And um, yeah, we're hopping back on the Slayer grind now. And we'll have Neve give us a good task. I really don't even care what I get. Watch it be a Jad task. I don't know how I would feel if I got a Jad task right here. Fossil Island Wyverns, all right, that's a fast task. All right, back on the Slayer grind now. Let's start working towards 85 Slayer. Currently 165k XP to the next level, which is kind of annoying. And we got the frog random right here. Let's get this uh, frog token. I love collecting these. No, no, not that one. <laughs> I did that earlier today too. Okay, here we go. Yes, I will kiss the frog. There we go. Frog token, add that onto the collection. Actually, I'm really curious right now. How many frog tokens do we even have in the bank? I have so many on my main, but I've never checked on here. Let's see. Let's deposit that and we'll check. Frog. 18 frog tokens. Ninja Impling. We got the butterfly net now. What do we get? What can we get from this? I got butterfly jar. No. I'm so bad at the game. Where'd it go? There it is. It's still here. No one else caught it. What do we get? Something good. Something good. Please don't escape me. Okay, let's see what we got. Weapon Poison Plus. Wait, I think it's actually good. I think the only thing we have is regular Weapon Poison from Anku. Yeah, all we have is regular Weapon Poison. So that's like an upgrade to the uh, the Dragon Dagger that we got. We got a uh, Dragon Dagger P. So if we get this Dragon Dagger, put the... Or if we unnote the weapon poison and we use it on the dagger, now it's a P plus upgrade. Amazing. Defense level, talking to Twitch chat. 82 defense. I, I, I fucking pulled an EV escape. But we got 82 defense here. Uh, did we get a combat level? No, we didn't. But um, yeah, we're, we got, we're on a troll task right now. And uh, I think I'm going to keep on working on defense for a while. Actually, we got a strength level because we're kind of close and then we'll go back to defense. All right, let's see what we get for this next task. The big number 219. Gargoyles, about to make some bonk. All right, so it's time to bank now, and I only have like half an inventory of stuff using up all my food, so I'm not even gonna bother switching spellbooks to Alk because it's not really necessary. Because yeah, this is all the loot, so don't have to worry about that because I'm too lazy. And um, I'm loving all the pure essence that we're getting. How much pure essence do we have right now, actually? Let's see. We got over nine, over 9,000 pure essence left. That's a lot. One of these days, we're going to spend a whole day or a few days training room crafting and get a bunch of total levels. But for now, it'll stay the lowest skill. And slightly off base 50s too. That's kind of making me a little bit upset, but that's fine. Why would people leave this on the ground? Who does this? That's like, oh, maybe it's like 5k or something. Still though, it's, it's pure GP. That's why we're all here for GP. It's sad. Yeah, this stack is actually 10k on the ground. Oh, I'm getting so upset. Whoever's doing this, if it's the guy with the fire max cape, because just because your max doesn't mean 10k is like not a lot. It's still like free GP. You just have to click on it. Ooh, is that is that my pure essence? No, I'm leaving pure essence on the ground too. I I need more pure essence. Why would someone do this to me? It's so much pure essence. <laughs> no, no, it's like it's like. 200 mil room crafting banked right there. No way, nature talisman. Okay, that makes up for it, honestly. That's great. Another nature talisman. And we have like, how many kills left? Seven kills left that came in so clutch right there. That's the second nature talisman of the task. How lucky are we? That's another benefit of being on the lunar spellbook is that we can use the NPC contact for every 10th task and talk to Duradel. Let's see what we get from him. Let's see what uh, he gives us. I really do enjoy Neve's tasks, but we have to get these extra points for the 10th assignment. Let's see what we get. Greater Demons, okay, that's decent. It's uh, AFK. Guys, oh, I another Nature Talisman. And we're like right at the start of the task too. Oh my gosh. What is the luck today? Here we go, one more hit. One more hit. What a nice guy tanking the hits for me. There is 89 strength, we got level 89. Oh, congrats, thank you, dude. And uh, no interruptions either. That's right at the end of the kill too. So that's like, officially the highest skill now it's above hit points i kind of want to go back to training range here but uh, we'll do defense for a little while and uh, we'll get back to range eventually 
We got the black dragon high chaps now, so we should be doing range. No way, another nature talisman. Did someone drop that? Oh, someone else dropped that. I actually thought I got the drop. Dang. You know, Slayer's pretty fun. It's fun going to all these tasks and making GP and gaining levels and... 182 Gargoyles, my favorite band, once again. And uh, we're gonna make some more money, get some more pure essence, and uh, still gonna save up for that runecrafting day we're gonna do eventually. Okay, so I caved in and decided to switch back from Lunars to the regular spellbook, but not just for Alchem though, but also the House Teleport. Because we can't make House Tele tabs until we get 67 construction to build a Mahogany Eagle Lectern. And we've got the Karen portal in the POH, which is gonna be so good to get to like every other Slayer task. So this way, on the regular spellbook, we can just use the POH Teleport, or even just use the regular Karen Teleport to get to the Catacombs, because as a hardcore Iron Man, by the way, it's really annoying to collect charges for the Xerix Talisman. I'm just looking at the character now, and with the torso and the fire cape upgrades, like, it seems like a pretty decent account. I mean, obviously there's still some upgrades that need to be made, but like, the character's looking pretty good, I gotta say. Every inventory of Gargoyles is such juicy loot. Like, if we ever got 99 Slayer, imagine how many other skills that would be able to supply. With like, all the Herblore drops, and Smithing drops, and Essence, and like, all the straight up cash, and like, there's so many good things that you get from Slayer. And here's a little range level coming in that I actually got on record. We've got level 86 range coming in here. Okay, so we just got a Rune Spear from a Fire Giant, and a Rune Spear is the third rarest item you can get from the rare drop table. And I'm pretty sure this is the first one that we've got on here. And we're going to need this for hard clue scrolls at some point. So it's nice that we finally got one now. So that way we don't have to drop those clue scrolls if or when we get them in the future. Uh, task complete. No slayer ring. Of course I forgot my slayer ring. It's okay, the bank's not too far off. Alright, Neve. Doesn't really matter what I get at this point. I just want to get the slayer XP. But um, let's see what we get here. Brine rats. Okay, that's fine. I haven't had that task in forever. Maybe we'll get like a brine saber or something cool, but it's a pretty easy task. I can two hit these guys now. Basically two hit Kip. Whoa, that's like perfect timing too. Right when I brought the recorder up, I actually did two hits on it. And we also got uh, bones to peaches, so we probably won't have to bank it all while we're here now. And they drop bones every kill, so uh, we'll have uh, plenty of supplies to last us. We got a brine saber! Just like that. It's only a 15k alk though. I don't know what I'll do with it, because I, I I have at least one in the bank. Maybe even two or more, possibly. I thought it was like 50k alk or something. What am I going to do with this? It's like a collectible item at this point. But we are going to be wrapping up today's video here, so I do hope that you enjoyed. Uh, I want to thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a great day, and I will see you again tomorrow.